In this video, we will demonstrate how to convert the Von Duprin electric latch exit device to the quiet electric latch. These are the tools you will need. For this opening, we will convert a standard 99EL rim exit device with no hex dogging to a QEL with the QELA baseplate conversion kit. In the box, you will find the baseplate, the cable, and instruction sheet. No additional fasteners are required. The fasteners from the standard EL device may be used. A flat workspace is necessary for this conversion. Before beginning this conversion, confirm that power has been disconnected from the power supply. Remove the four screws from the center case cover and remove the cover. Remove the two screws in the end cap, then remove the cap. Slide out the cover plate. Remove the end cap bracket if desired, or simply loosen it to allow for easier removal of the device. Remove the two screws in the center case reinforcing bracket. Then remove the bracket. Once the electrical connections have been disconnected, remove the remaining screws from the center case, and then carefully remove the trim and exit device from the door. Lay the exit device on a flat surface. With the straight edge screwdriver or 5 16 nut driver, remove the two screws from the mechanism case and remove the bracket. Hold the push bar down and slide the mechanism case off of the device. Remove the push bar and guides from the base plate. Using the straight edge screwdriver, remove the retaining clip from the connector pin and remove the pin. Turn the base plate over and remove the two screws holding the center case to the base plate with the Phillips screwdriver. Note the locations where these screws were fastened. Remove the base plate from the assembly and set the QEL base plate in position. Install the two Phillips screws to the center case. Use the same two holes used for the EL base plate. If you are unsure which holes to use, look at the EL base plate for marks made by the previous screws. Insert the connector pin through the base plate and center case pushing the retraction bracket back as needed. Installing the pin so that the head is on top when the device is installed on the door is recommended. Install the retaining clip. Slide the push bar guides onto the push bar. While holding the guides in place, reinstall the push bar. Slide the base plate into the mechanism case, being careful not to pinch any wires. Hold the push bar all the way down to line up the push bar guides with the opening of the mechanism case. Reinstall the one piece cover bracket and secure with the two screws using the straight edge screwdriver or 5 16 nut driver. Install the trim and exit device, securing the center case with all six screws.
ensure the reinforcing bracket of the center case is installed and secured with the two screws. Once electrical connections have been made, slide the cover plate back in place, being careful not to pinch any wires. Route the cable through the hole in the end cap bracket, tighten the screws, and install the end cap. Install the center case cover and secure with the four screws. Testing retraction prior to completing installation is recommended. For assistance, contact customer care at 877-671-7011.